All right, all right, all right. Hey, YouTube, I'm Lucky. And in today's news story, I have something very interesting to cover, which is that a group of hackers slash data miners have figured out a way to create their own custom emblems that actually work inside Destiny 2. Yes, you heard me right. They can make their own emblem, anything they want it to be, and you can actually equip it inside Destiny 2. Go ahead and watch this clip here with me. All right, here we have it. They have Ginzor, who's like a very well-known data miner. This is uh, his Destiny 2 account. It says right at the top, Hacker Man, his own unique emblem. You can see his emblem right here. He's got like a picture of someone with a keyboard. Look like a hacker up there at the top. That is pretty crazy. It looks like it's a fresh account as well. So probably didn't do it on his main account, considering that he might get banned. But pretty crazy stuff that these hackers slash data miners are able to do. And these are actually the same two data miners or hackers. I'm not sure which one you'd call them. Let me know in the comments. Should I call them data miners or hackers? I don't know. It says hacker man up there. So I'm gonna call them hackers for now. But Ginzor and Montague, these are the same guys who have done a bunch of data mining in the past. Montague posted that trailer of like St. 14's transformation or like the monster trailer of him like a month before that came out. And Ginzer has been bringing leaks of DLCs and things that are coming out very soon. And they did actually post recently saying that they finished like finding out some leaks recently. So they're probably going to end up leaking very soon here, all of the stuff that's going to come out in the December 7th update. So stay tuned for that. I'll definitely be covering some of that, but I'll put spoiler in the title of the video though. So if you don't want to watch those videos, if you see spoiler at the top, just don't click on those videos. But pretty crazy stuff overall, right? Being able to custom create your own Destiny emblem. These are the same guys that created the starting screen. They rechanged the starting screen for Destiny 2. So they're doing a bunch of pretty wild stuff and they're somehow they're able to continuously, you know, get into the files and change things in Destiny 2. And they don't seem to be doing anything malicious. So I don't particularly dislike these guys. I don't think that they're like introducing hacks into like PvP or anything like that. They're just sort of doing like quirky, weird things. So personally, I don't have a problem with them. Let me know your thoughts about these guys in the comments down below. And also let me know if you could make your very own custom emblem in Destiny 2, what would you make your emblem say? And what would you make your emblem look like in Destiny 2? That's a wrap on this news story. Make sure to subscribe with notifications on if you did enjoy. Smash the like button. I'll see you in the next one. Later.